Gmail and its accompanying office suites provides both businesses and the casual user a great set of apps that come in handy both at home and in the office. Should you need to keep two parts of your life apart, you can always make another account. If you've got different Gmail accounts for your professional and personal life, you may want to further distinguish between the two to prevent any mix-ups. An easy way to do this is to give the name attached to your personal account a bit more personality. If you want to change your name on Gmail, here's what you need to know. By default, Gmail sends your emails using the same name you used when you sign up for your Google account alongside your email. Any changes you make to the name you use for your Google account will automatically be reflected in Gmail. To change the name you use to sign up, head over to myaccount.google.com and sign in if you have not already. Once your account page loads, click on the Personal Info tab at the top, then click on Name. From here, you can edit your first and last name freely, then save the changes by clicking on Save. Note that the changes to your name will reflect across your Google account. If you want to use something else without changing the name on your Google account, you'll need to log into your Gmail account via desktop browser. Head over to gmail.com and log into or switch to the account you want to manage. Once you're in, click on the gear icon at the top right, then on See All Settings. Once your settings page loads, click on the Accounts and Import tab. Next to Send Mail As, you'll see your current name on Gmail next to your email address. To change your name, click on Edit Info. On the editing window that pops up, click on the bullet point next to the blank box. Type in your new name, then click Save Changes. This will change your name as it appears when you send something to another person's inbox. Note that you cannot change your email address or username. If you get any errors that tell you that settings cannot be changed, you may have changed your name one too many times over a short span of time, or you're on a Google Workspace account and your admin has prohibited it. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Gmail and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.